video, and on it, we hear exactly how police found the driver and why she says she didn't stop. This dash cam video shows Bentonville police out before sunrise this morning, driving the streets on the lookout for the driver of a dark-colored mid-sized four-door car. Almost exactly 24 hours to the minute from when the accident occurred. A traffic camera near the intersection of State Highway 12 and Sunbrook Street in Bentonville picked up the accident that killed a man yesterday. On the dash cam video, we hear a police officer explain how she spotted the driver of the car today, 62-year-old Tommy Prickett. That was a great call. I was on the phone. Do you know what, what to put me in? Uh -huh. The back glass. The uh, back glass? The way the shape of the back oh. glass is, the side glass. I, I, as soon as I saw it, it just something hit yeah. me, and I just grabbed my mind to me, like, what? take this one. And you see he did here on Featherson Avenue. We passed him. He's like, you know what? The, the, the brake lights match. So he got behind me. Awesome. And her, her driver's side brake light, her driver's side brake light on Highway 12, she hit her brake to slow down for a car in front of her, and her driver's side brake light didn't light up. So I lit her up there. On, she turned here on Featherston. I lit her up, and sure enough, when she turned, I lit her up and she hit her brake. They both just came on. Prickett told the officer what she thought happened. And then he went up and talked to her again when I was running her, and she she said she that it must have lost. She was like, well, I think it. Was. She said it must have, something about it either lost crash or she hit her. Darkness had turned to light as Prickett was brought into the station to talk more about the deadly accident. Now Prickett was not arrested and isn't facing any charges right now. The police chief says they'll complete this investigation and then turn over all the evidence over to the prosecutor's office.